Jeff Todd from MLB Trade Rumors here. Today is Thursday, January 23rd. Let's get you caught up. It's never ideal to have to hire two managers in the same offseason, but the Mets are hoping to make the best of the situation by adding Luis Rojas to take over for Carlos Beltran. Beltran, of course, was removed from office after a very brief stint that didn't even include any appearances in uniform because of his role with the Astros sign-stealing scandal a few years ago. The 38-year-old has exactly one season in a big league uniform last year as a quality control coach for the Mets. It's quite a different path to the position than Beltran took, and the Mets simply have to hope that they made the right call in going with Rojas, a guy they did consider before they originally hired Beltran. There was one rather notable signing yesterday, though it wasn't an unexpected one. The Royals agreed to terms on a one-year $4 million deal with outfielder Alex Gordon. He'll be back in Kansas City yet again. It's a long-expected move for the three-time All-Star and seven-time Gold Glove winner. He won't be expected to do much more than be a solid, reliable veteran who grinds out at bats and gives good effort out in the outfield. But every team, no matter where they are in the competitive process, has to have solid guys like this around, and Gordon certainly makes sense in Kansas City. There were a few rumors yesterday as well. The Blue Jays reportedly joined the Reds with interest in utility man Brock Holt, and the Reds are said still to have some interest in slugging outfielder Nicholas Castellanos, although it's really not clear where he'd fit. Folks, this is also the time of year when we're going to see a lot of memorable names landing minor league deals in an effort to keep their careers going. It seems like one team lands a couple of these guys every year. So far in 2020, it is the Phillies. Neil Walker, Francisco Liriano, joining Phillies camp to compete with players like Josh Harrison and Drew Storen should be fun to watch. Also yesterday, Hector Santiago landed with the Tigers, Jacob Barnes signed with the Angels, and several other veterans inked minor league contracts. You're going to want to head over to MLBTradeRumors.com to catch up on that and subscribe below for all of our videos.